Hey everyone, another application made using Tinkter can be a text editor. We haven't yet explored the file dialog module by Tinkter. It needs to be imported separately. The module provides classes and factory functions for creating file or directory selection windows. We have native loads, static factory functions, convenience classes. Convenience classes help in creating files or directories from scratch, while static factory functions are user responsive. So the text editor that we would make would have two static factory functions, open and save. So let's start making the application right away. I'll import Tinkter. I'll write from Tinkter, import star, and from Tinkter, dot file dialog import ask open file name ask save as file name we would use the ask open file name for opening a file for editing and the ask save as file name for saving the current file as a new file now I'll get my window. I'll write window equals tk. And window.title. So the title can be text editor. Fine. Now I'll get a text widget to insert multiple lines so that I can write on it. A text editor needs inputs, so this is how I'll give them the inputs. And even for displaying some text, I need a field, so I'll use the text widget. So I'll have this variable text equals text. Where do I want it? I want it on my window, so I'll write window. Foreground, I'll set some foreground. I'll give it purple, the foreground. And background equals light yellow that would be a nice combination and font let it be calibri 14 fine then i'll pack this i'll write txt text dot pack i will get a menu now to have the open and save as options just like in a text editor so i will name the menu file for that i should write menu equals menu and on the window so window now i'll configure it i'll write window.config menu equals menu and now file menu equals menu and in brackets again menu now i'll add the options first to the main menu I'll write menu dot add cascade label equals file and menu equals file menu. Then to the file menu I'll add open and save as so I'll write file menu dot add command label equals open comma command for now i'll leave it blank and file menu dot add command label equals save as and command again let's leave it blank for right now and i'll call window dot main loop Fine. Now I need these two functions, open a file and save a new file. So the first function to open a file, let's define it. I'll write def open file brackets and I'll write file path equals ask open file name file types equals 
in a list in a tuple text files comma the extension for them star dot txt and again comma and the tuple all files comma the extensions this statement will open a dialog box so that the user can select the file to be opened since we are working with only text files i could have only given the tuple text files but what we have written now lets you access all the kinds of files that can be presented or read by the text editor now after the dialog box is opened it might happen that the user clicks on the cancel or closes the window so for that case i'll write if not file path if no file path is selected you return no further code is executed otherwise i'll delete whatever is there currently on the text editor i'll write txt dot delete i hope you remember txt was our text widget and i'll delete whatever is there on the text editor currently from index 1 so 1 1.0 till the end end fine now i need my text file to be read the selected file to be read so for that i'll write with open file path as an argument mode should be only read so r and you can pass an encoding utf dash 8 as input file text is equals to input file dot read now this string as read is inserted in the text editor so i'll use the insert function of the text widget so i'll write txt dot insert and text fine and finally i should change the title of the window to the file path okay so i'll write window dot title f simple text editor and file path so this is a python format for getting the values i hope you know this and okay now very similarly i should define the save file function too so i'll write def save underscore file and brackets okay so this would be for saving the current file as a new file firstly i need to create the file path to get the location of the file to be saved so i'll write file path equals ask save as file name default extension dot txt so how the file should be saved with the extension dot txt unless specified and file types again similarly in a list then in a tuple text files and the extension star dot txt again you can give in the all files or not it's your wish then all files and star dot star fine now again if the screen is cancelled you do not need to run any further code for that i'll write if not file path return otherwise a new file is created the text on the text editor is extracted for the same so how would i do it i'll write with open I'll give in the file path. I already have it. Mode now would be W so that it is writable. Encoding equals UTF-8 as output file. Okay. Now text equals txt.get 
from 1.0 till index end. Okay, the output file gets the text. So I'll write output underscore file dot write text. And again, the title needs to be changed to file path. So I'll write window dot title f simple text editor and file path in curly braces. And that's pretty much it for the two functions. Now I need to pass these two functions as the commands for the two menu options. So I'll write for file menu one, command equals open file where the label was open. And for save as, I'll write the command save underscore file. We are good to go. Let's run this and see if the text editor works properly. So I have the window and please note that the title is text editor. It would change later. I have a light yellow background. I have this file menu and I can have open and save as as options. So I'll just type in something. I'll write this is a Tinkter application, a simple text editor. And I'll save it now. I'll click on file. I'll click on save as and I have this pop up window and it is asking me the file name. So I'll name it as Tinkter and I'll click on save. Now I'll again go to file and click on open. I will click on Tinkter and I'll click on open. So here I have my text that I just saved. The title has also changed to file path. So this was a simple text editor. Thank you.